Hello everyone and welcome to this week's Tech Tip Tuesday. My name is Rachel and today I'll be showing you how to use the MTA app. So the first thing you're going to want to do is look up My MTA. Once you've downloaded this app, you're going to want to click the open button. Now, this is the screen that you'll be faced with. You have three options. You can either look for a subway, look for a bus, or look for a railroad. Now, let's say I want to look at the subway. I'll scroll down until I find the subway of choice. I want to take the queue. Now, let's say I'm starting at 72nd Street, and I want to know how long until the next subway gets here. I just click on the thing that says 72nd Street and see, okay, for an uptown train to 96th Street, it's coming in 10 minutes. For a downtown train, it's coming in eight minutes. But let's say I don't wanna take the subway and I wanna take the bus. I'll click the bus. Now let's say I wanna take the M101. I will type that into the search bar and click it. Now, let's say I want to go downtown and I'm starting on 96th Street. Not only does it show me the M101, but it shows me all the other buses at that stop as well. So I can see which is the quickest way to my destination. So currently there's a 103 there. There's eight minutes till the 101, six minutes till 102, and 38 minutes until the Bronx Express bus. Lastly, I can look at the Long Island Railroad schedules and different rail schedules. It gives me options and I can plan a trip and find a schedule. I can see the North Metro Railroad as well and it will tell me what schedule it is. And again, they will show me this map to help me find out where everything is. That was this week's Tech Tip Tuesday on how to use the MTA app. If you enjoyed this tutorial and you are interested in enrolling in a full class with us, please visit mittlerseniortech.com. Thank you for watching.